Tina Sashimi.
Get the iPad sorted in a minute. The battery ran out. Well, it almost ran out. Ran into battery saving mode. I've been playing a bit of um, East 5 on the uh, SNES. So I thought I'll carry on a little bit. Apparently it's not very big. I played for about three hours. Apparently it's only about five, six hours long. Oh, hang on a minute. I can't remember to turn that off a minute, otherwise. I thought I could hear my voice doubling back on myself. One second. Right, happy days. I should be better. Hopefully. So I'm not going to be hearing myself all night. Just notice as well, the new King of Fighters is on offer on Steam. I was thinking about buying the PS4 version, but apparently the Steam version is the best one. Apparently it's the uh, fastest performing version. But we'll see. Right, okay. Back on. Yeah, we're doing. Julian, how's it going, mate? All right. But I'd uh, play this a little bit. Right, I've done four hours and 30 minutes on it. How's it going, mate? Right? So apparently this game's not that... Uh, it's not that big. Right, I went far off going somewhere, I think. We'll have, of course, some other games later as well. No, if it turns out I don't have the money and equipment to probably stack. A whole lot of antidotes, okay. Good tip. Oh, do you? Ah, uh, no. I tell you what, mind that's easy done. My ex boss used to do all the time. He used to go out on the weekend to like a rally, and he'd refuse to wear the hat. And literally, he would come back every time, and he burned his. He literally burned his face to pieces. And he'd never learn. Do it. Do it like twice, three times a year. But yeah, it, it, it's, it could be easily done, can't it? Um, okay, I am skinned. That's right, last night I topped up a load of stuff. Well, I hope it ain't too bad. Sunburn's a bit of a nightmare as well, because it takes plenty of ages, days and days before I stop stinging. Right, okay. We never to leave this town, it's not boring. Maybe we could do something. Uh, no, probably not. Okay, cool. Yeah, I tooled myself up in this last night. What I'd say about this, this is probably the first East game I've played that doesn't really seem like an East game. Evening, Dean, how's it going? I do a Thursday stream because uh, I'm not going to be on uh, on Saturday or Sunday, but hopefully on Monday. We'll just have a chill out night and just play whatever comes. Whatever comes to it. It's very rare. The kind of disappeared has changed. Hey Dean, I got. Um, some emails back off that uh, guy doing the panel. Um, he's done me a panel design for what I asked, and um, I'm going to sort him out the uh, money for it on the fifteenth. I would, I was going to do it. I was going to do it today, but with this red and that come up, I spent a little bit more than I should have. But he, he did eventually get back to me. He's cool with the fifteenth, he said. So it looks. Nice the pan. It's going to work out $166, I think he said. 
Where did travel? Where did swords fall into place? That's a panel of eight buttons. Um, start and coin. All designed. Looks very much like the, the original panel. He sent me a picture when he, a two-player panel he did. Looks sweet. Yeah, I'd like to give him the money now, really, but, um, yeah, totally skid me out. I got paid soon, anyway, so it's not long. It's only literally another week. It's like a week Monday, I think it is. It'll probably take him a while to do the panel and send it to me, anyway. Yeah, I've heard loads of people now saying his panels are really good. I think this is where I've got to go. Okay, the pub. This is Gana Thieves who keep pinching my stuff. I've got to go after him. Apparently, this is one of the shortest East games. I said, this is underlying very. The dungeons are not particularly that big either, and the bosses are quite easy. Ah, oh, right, okay. That's cool. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it off. I said I might have the money before, but if not, I'll uh, pay you up on the 15th for it, so... Like I say, it's only, it's only just over the week anyway, so... Like I say, it might take him a while to send it to me anyway. The thing I'd say about this one, there's a few things you need to do at the beginning. They're a bit tricky to work out. I wandered around for ages and I know what the hell I was doing. Drop in the filaments that right, okay. Yeah, I'm, um, I've watched a couple of videos now, well, a couple of Twitter videos of um, some Japanese people. The, initially, the one said he tried different power spikes. It didn't make a difference. But I've I've seen a few Twitter posts now, um, especially I seen one today. Who, well, he's either today or yesterday, last night I seen it. And he said he said he tried um, about five or something different power supplies, all the way up to a five amp one. And he reckons that it did significantly change the input lag on it. They said the same about the um, Egret Mini one. It, it also says on, apparently it says on the box, you need a 2 amp power supply. So it's, a, it's like the PlayStation. The PlayStation one requires uh, a more powerful um, ampage power supply, whereas it literally doesn't turn on. So it does sort of make sense that it might be running in a, a low power mode if you're not giving it enough juice. He, he reckoned some of the games changed as soon as he uh, some of the games that were more laggy than others as soon as he went to the higher power supply uh, they got better basically it's a bit of an odd East game this one is. It's the first time they've gone into proper, you know, jump and attack sort of um, action sort of adventure. And it's a bit, it's like, it, it's nowhere near as good as the new ones. And it's like it's a transition period. And apparently this game didn't do particularly very well. It's like Dorman finally made it to the Phantom City. I guess I must have made it there. I've been hired by this uh, Dorman guy. Yeah, 
This place is all time. Okay, so look what else he says. Uh, yeah, that, that's what a um, few of them have been saying that. They've been saying that, um, yeah, Raiden apparently plays really well. And apparently Batsugan is not too bad either. And somebody said, um, I think it was Strikers. He said once he did the, the post by Strikers played right as well. I've got a couple of different post splides here. When I get it, I'll try it. Because when, when I first used the Egret one, the one I was using, it kept cutting off. And I had to change to a more powerful one. Yeah. It, at, at the end of the day, it's not a serious console then. And as long as as long as you know what you're getting into and it's playable, that's all you want, isn't it? Like you can deal with a bit of lag. No, everyone's used to playing emulators, you know, a couple a couple of frames you can sort out, no probs. But um yeah, it, it didn't sound very good what people said, but it, it could be they're using low-power PSUs on it. Now, you're all right. You can have as much amperage as possible, can you? As long as you just don't uh, up the voltage. <laughs> so, you could put like a 20 amp power supply on you if you wanted to, as long as you don't have any more than 5 volts. Yeah, th there is. Our mister did catch up a little bit, didn't it? Yeah, yeah, fine. We've got to remember with Ampage is when it comes to power supplies, uh, the machine will only take whatever amps it requires. So say you put a, a 30 amp power supply on something that takes two amps, that machine will only ever ask for two amps. But it, it's the voltage, the, it's the voltage that really makes the difference. So you can imagine, like, how, how do you put it? If you go to electronics class, they, they say it like this. It's basically your ampage is your tank. So they say your water tank, the size of your water tank. So the bigger your water tank is, the, 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 more, the more water you can pump through your, um, your pipes. But your voltage is, is your pipes. So your limit. So the bigger the voltage, you chuck too much water through it and ruin your system. If that makes any sense whatsoever. But yeah, folded uh, ampage is fine. You can go higher on ampage, no problems at all. But it, it's the it's the voltage you've got to make sure you get right. No, I reckon the voltage is not good. <laughs> no, it's the ampage it is. No, I reckon the voltage would be pretty bad. Yeah, so it, it, it's like it's good to know that is because you can always overamp any equipment as long as you just make sure you get the voltage correct. Because you can imagine you've got all that ampage and you you got your voltage right, so your water system essentially can only flow so much water through those pipes at once. So it doesn't matter how much how big your tank is, there's only so much water flow you can get. So then if you if you up your pipes. You can essentially chuck more water through, through there in one go. That's sort of how they explained it to me in uh, when I did electronics class. And it, it does make sense. Yeah, it, it requires two at least. It's like the PlayStation Mini. One of the new new foam ones might be all right. They, they usually two amp. If not, you can get... I'm pretty sure you can get uh, ones up to about four amp, like phone chargers, on um, Amazon for about a tenner. I bought, I bought one. I think it was a tenner. It's got four ports on it, and it can it can give uh, items. I think it's like three three amps, four items, three amps at once, all at the same time. Yeah, what you're getting with 24 volt in it is essentially you, you, you're higher in your you higher, yeah you're higher in your fan speed there essentially you know. Sure if we could take you past the desert all the way back to Alexandria. Okay, I don't want to get that way in. Where do these? Uh, 
dodgy thief can run this way. <laughs> yeah, 24 VOD fans uh, should be able to spin pretty fast. <laughs> right, let's go and see, do some adventure and see if I can work my way through it. Yeah, the Venture is uh it's the first time they've done proper sword combat. You gotta watch them things, they bloody uh poison it, which is a bit of a pain. If I remember rightly, where I need to go is over here. It's weird this game is it doesn't it doesn't feel like an East game. The way it's written as well is is really different. Hey John Zini? I wanna try and beat it because I wanna I wanna complete all the East games and then I'll go on to well I've done some of the side games anyway. They got a weird money system in this. Instead of collecting money from enemies, you collect um, like diamonds and crystals from them. And then you, when you go to a shop, you have to trade in those crystals for money. I, I don't know why they did that, which is a bit strange. Plus, the menu system's a bit odd. They got this menu system. When you pull down, they swap some around. Or left and the right, they swap some around. It's, it's a bit odd how they've done it, but it works. I have played this before on the SNES, but I didn't like it. I didn't really get into it. But I was trying to play in Japanese, I suppose. So I got a full translated one for you. I've done a little bit of hogging as well. Don't know whether this is where I need to go. So I powered up my equipment a bit. I couldn't get past this bit last night. Oh, I scanned and get past it now, I think. It's not particularly very difficult either compared to the other East games. The other East games are definitely harder. So, how do I get over there then? So I am tempted to pick a King of Fighters up. We had to play on the cabin. Yeah, this is the game they first did uh, like a full-on proper action system in. Apparently it, did, it didn't do very well. Right, I may have to go back to the town a minute to figure out where I'm going. Where did I say this was? Does it flash up and tell me where it is? Waterway entrance, right, that's the waterway. How's it going, John Zine? You alright? Jumping's a little bit weird in here as well. Jump on things you wouldn't think you would jump on. Okay, poison me, great. Um, we're on the mend, good, good, that's good to hear me. Alright Bean, how's it going? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do, do, do. 
dodging these purposely because uh, it's a pain in the ass to fight. Be a woodcutter. So, if I remember rightly, select. Tell me where I am. I want to start the East 6 next. And that's it then. I've been through all the main East games. And I've, I've completed some of the side ones. Uh, I'll start on the rest of the side games then. Ah, oh, that's what I want to have a look at. Ah, uh, turn it around. Gordon, several planes. This is East 5 on uh, the SNES. This is where I'm getting up to, basically. Ooh, okay. Okay, that was random to find one there. Say it's a bit weird, it doesn't really feel like an East game. Yeah, it does. It, it, it's very SNES looking, isn't it? It's not a bad thing, it's very, it sounds very SNES as well. Right, where was that guy? I still want. I want to play through um, Secret of Mana two as well. I've been wanting to play through that for a long time. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to do that at some point. Okay. You want to make some flex stone yet? Ah, it's gonna do something now. You could mix elements together. Give you different magics. What did I get? Um, okay, so what did I what did I get? Evokes lava throwing uh, magic, okay. Water fire fire. Alright, okay, I can do it there. Strange feeling for a second, giving you a boost. Ah, I could swap in the moat, can I? Ooh, that's weird. Oh. I've never seen you do art before, that's weird. I'm sorry if I go back in, is this still messed up? Yeah, it is. It's got to be an emulation thing now, hasn't it? Gives a gentle sun. Okay, that'll do. Because you can use magic. Yeah, it's a fan translation. Can't really play it that way, unfortunately. I did try it in Japanese before. Actually, I should talk to the bartender. Yeah, I'm not sure when they got translated. I normally save... Oh, not in bars, in inns. Forgot about that. You go into an inn and then you can save the classic old uh, RPG trait, that is. The thing I would say is it can be a little bit tricky to figure out where to go on you. Because it's about 500 years ago. This is also the east was uh, once green and vibrant. I think this would be a chance to become barren and almost lifeless. 
Okay. I gotta get to the desert app. Is in. Right, okay. The sound is very snatched as well, doesn't it? I would also say the music on this one is nowhere near as good as the other games. It's okay, it does the job, but. Okay, so it goes east the plane. I did do a bit of hogging to get some good equipment. So I need to figure out what the hell I do with these, uh... So this is the only way to go unless I go back. So what am I missing then? I must be able to fall off somewhere. Or well, I gotta release the water, because I can't say I can't open that. But it's just locked. Okay, so you can get down there, but can't get in it. All right, that takes me back there. The, I've beaten these four on the PC Engine now, but apparently um, Falcon only only basically take the SNES version as uh, canon, so I don't know whether I should play for the SNES version at some point, but the PC Engine one is supposed to be better. See, so where do I go from here then? It almost looks like it's something to do with these platforms, isn't it? There's water, obviously, i got to release the Gefu Year somewhere. How do I get down there? It is a bit weird looking as well. It doesn't. Sometimes it looks like you can't get places, but you can. I can't really do anything. That drops me back down to there. Suck that one, I can't jump off here. So I need to get in there somehow, by the look of it. Question is, don't even budge. Bit of a shit, that is it. Oh, hang on, why am I down there? Oh, secret bit. That's a bit sneaky. So I can get down there. That's a bit sneaky, isn't it? But never there. I can't get anyway. Hmm. What am I missing then? 
Like, it is a little bit tricky to advance a story. Each time I've done it, got to another dungeon, it's taken a while to figure it out. If you stand still when you're outside, I should start to be gaining energy. I've only had to use one energy power up so far. I was on one boss, I probably didn't need to use it. <sighs> oh, what the hell? Got me stuck in. So what am I missing then? I think I've talked to everyone. If you pass the death, all the way back. I don't want to go back. Hmm. Obviously, somebody I need to speak to. I think. No one else has ever has come back in days. That was the water place, not the ruins, wasn't it? This house is in there. I had fire burns inside the ruins for years, but I thought. So, yeah. so it looks like I gotta get to the ruins, not that water place. Like, like that, says Gwen. <laughs> no. I noticed you play in um, SCI on the uh, Master System, oh? I remember that being half decent for the Master System game. Any good? Let's have a look upstairs, just in case I missed somebody up here. Nope. Nothing I can walk into a pinch anything. Funny in these games, isn't it? You can uh, walk around pinching things. Ah, okay. Right now, looking for some stuff, I guess. Where's the ruins? That's the question. It looks like where I've got to go next. What's my map doing here? Not much. So what's the, uh, what is, is the Master System Challenge now? Just to get that many points as possible, is it? Yeah, I, I remember it being pretty decent. I think I had Chase HQ and SCI on the uh, my system. One shot, I can't believe it. Eight inch recovery from the real sale. I was at Alexandria. Right, have I got to find that shop then? Okay, I can't go in there then. Where is the normal shop? Yeah, it's weird, man. I show how money works. It's really strange. You basically pick crystals up, so you've got to go to gems, the ones you've picked up, and then you swap the gems for cash. So you've got like an extra step for like. No reason at all, essentially. Um. What is it? 
Don't really give me a clue where to go. Apart from the ruins. Might go looking for him now. Um, okay, let's go looking for the ruins. I guess some cash when I'm at it. Window element, nice. It's easier to dodge them than it is to buddy get stung by them. Right, I did go here once and they couldn't get through it. Okay, that goes me down here. <laughs> Sounds like a Casio keyboard. I say the music is nowhere near as good as your usual East music. The music's okay though. Oh, you shit. Apparently there's a jump in, I watched a review of it, and there's, there's a jump in bit, the super annoying. You couldn't get across it without those things uh, touching him, but you have got fire magic. Um, perspective's a bit weird, isn't it? Never been up here before, so. <laughs> oh, the map's useless. It just shows you roughly where you are. That's it. Can't do anything with it. Can't move around or anything. Ah, okay. This must be the way I need to go. Okay, I don't want to make flex stone. Record your process. Yeah, we do that. We record it. Say so one uh, one review said it was about five six hours long. It doesn't sound like a... The story doesn't read like an East game either. I'll sell my gems, may as well. Strange eyes, haven't I? Ooh, scale mail. Ooh, interesting. I haven't seen that before. That must be new um, armour. So I could sell my round shield. I don't need that anymore. Right, okay. I think that's better armor than I had. Um, oh no, I just bought scale mail again. Balls. I should check first, shouldn't I? Oh well. Not much here to speak of for what? Some kinds of treasure in the cave behind the waterfall. Okay, so that's where you go. Any secret stash to pick up anyway? Anyway, I could rob the joint. Oh well, I may as well sell that scale mail at a bloody loss. Yeah, the SNES was definitely the best console for JRPGs. Oh, that's a good loss, that is, as well. Oh, well. Easy come, easy go. I played for quite a lot of them on the SNES. 
I did have a bit of a splurge when I when I had the SNES at one point. Yeah, that's quite nice. That I, I started going through the JRPGs. I played some of them a bit dodgy, but I played some lo lots of really good ones. Right, this must be the bit with the dodgy jumps. Okay, don't want to. Uh... I'm underwater. Uh oh. Okay, I'm good. Oh, I can see this bit being... I think this is the bit that guy was talking about. What you can do is you can power up your magic by holding down the button. And you get a fireball. Right, okay. You can't control that jump either. Yeah, this is definitely the bit he was talking about. So can I get over there? Ooh. A shield ring, nice. Um, okay, I don't think I've had any rings lately. At least on this. Nice. Uh oh, wrong button. Yeah, once you jump, you can't you can't control it in midair. Right, let's try that again. Now. Yeah, my favourite ones. Um, Secret of Mana is my favourite one. Zelda was good as well, Secret of Mana is amazing. Um, Soul Blazer was really good. I'm trying to think what else. Final Fantasy VII is really good. Uh, six, sorry. That's brilliant. Um, I tried a few other ones which I didn't get on with that much. Illusion of Gaia is okay, it's nothing brilliant. Gets a lot of praise, but it's a bit boring. Uh, try to think of whatever ones I played. Um, okay, so it's got to be up there. Oh, ah, this is that bit. You showed it in the video, this bit. You kept getting knocked off. So I'm going to use my head and charge magic. The only problem that takes a fair amount of shots to kill him. God, how do I get over there then? Oh, that's a dodgy jump, isn't it? Nah, I knew I wouldn't work. <laughs> Try to think of other ones I played. So Soul Blazer I definitely enjoyed. Is it Laugh ones there or something like that too? That was a bit boring, you've got a really tiny sword in it. I know it's like it's not good to have a tiny sword. You literally couldn't hit anything. I played that a little bit, it was okay. Chrono Trigger, I've played about about 10, 15 hours of that twice and then got bored of it. it I don't think it's that great. I know everyone rates it as the next big thing, but I don't know. I might, funny enough, um, X Mosquito uh, played it not long ago, literally probably about a month or so ago, and he played about 10 hours on it and got bored as well. So it wasn't just me. 
I don't think it's it's not as good as Secret of Mana. Right, okay, so let's try this charge thing again. It looks nice, Chrono Trigger Mind. It looks lovely. Oh, I better up a level, then. Huh? Right, okay. So is this just a bit of a bastard of a jump? How the hell do I get across here? Chrono Trigger I wanted to get into because it, it looks it looks really nice but yeah I don't know There's something boring about it I don't know why okay everyone does rate that game as being the best RPG on the SNES but yeah Easter it almost was I'm trying to think what other ones I played That jump is not funny, is it? I want whatever's in that uh, in that chest, though. Right, charge again. I never played Earthbound. A lot of people really rate that game, don't they? But I, I, I've never got into it. It's supposed to be great. I've, I've I quickly had a go of it. Do you reckon I can get a bit further now? Oh, you can. Oh, nearly. Hmm. Okay. How do I get over there then? I want to check something out a minute. How far can I go before I fall off that edge? Oh, you can walk right off the edge. Okay, that gives me... I think we've earthbound. I, I didn't dig the look of it. Because you're just playing a couple of kids walking around towns and I knew. I think that's why I, I wasn't really that bothered in playing it. Even though a lot of people say it's it's really, really good. Go off you. Should get like a list of games up. I do I know, hang on. A list of SNES RPGs. Let's have a look which ones I've actually played. This SNES RPG games. And one I really did enjoy was um it's called Shadow Warrior. Not Shadow Warrior, Shadow... I'll find it now. Right, so what have we got then? So, let's have a look at the list then. Chrono Trigger, like I said, got bored of it. Earthbound never played. Secret of Man is brilliant. Um, I don't think I played them too. Star Ocean is supposed to be fantastic. Final Fantasy VI, which is amazing. Illusion of Gaia was okay, never really played him much. Secret of Evermore, the same way, I've not played that much. Breath of Fire 2, I think I did try that, and thought it was okay, but I don't think I finished it. 
Terra Enigma is one of those that I never bothered finishing either. Soul Blazer I did. Shadow Run, that's the one. I really like that on the SNES. Um, Breath of Fire, I haven't played the original. I didn't play the earlier Final Fantasies either. Mario RPG I've never played. Star Ocean I haven't. Act is in it. It's not really an RPG, is it? Star Ocean on 360, mine. I played that for about 30 odd hours. I really enjoyed that, but I never, I never got around to finish it for some reason. Oh, I never bothered to. Yeah, translation can't allow to be quite nice. I made a nice translation card of um, uh, Secret of Mana 2 or something to do with him, whatever, free. So I, I fixed the battery on it for him and then uh, he was like, oh, I want to play it. I spent ages fixing the battery and it was like wire, wire hell on the inside. And then as soon as I fixed the battery, he sold it. I probably would have had that off him. Jumps a bit of a bastard, isn't he? He started dying underwater. Okay, is there a trick for doing that jump then? Yeah, I do use Star Ocean, supposed to be really good. No. Right, so you got anything you can tell me? Tefius, as he came here, I said it was going to investigate. He hasn't shown up yet again, so I need to find that cave. One in Limestone Cave behind the waterfall. Go there soon. So I can get behind the waterfall then. Where is the cave behind the water hole? Oh, oh, water element, nice. It's weird. You don't even know those things are there. They just, they just turn up. Right, I got a gap there somehow. What do you reckon? Up there? It looks like an entrance there, doesn't it? Possibly. Question is, I bet there's a double jump. Uh, quick save, equipment. Got worse, haven't it? Basically, give me two bases to open it, okay. So, how do I get up there then? Okay. Do I jump off someone else? This is the waterfall, so there's a cave here on me. Nope. I'll teach you to do it fast. The 
is more RPGs than they were on that list. So Soul Blazer and uh, that other one I was thinking of with the tiny sword, that's not on the list either. So I'm looking for a cave somewhere. Let's do a charge. Nope. That ain't me in the water. It's a bit sneaky on this sometimes. They, I've noticed. It'll show you areas you can't see. You need to go around the corner to get to them. Never done any uh, translations on uh, SNES cartridges. I haven't got any prompt burn, I suppose. That look easy enough to do, mind. Okay, let's try going over there again. Right, can I go this way? Nope, definitely can't go over there. Oh, hang on. Oh, I must have been up here before. Yeah. And I can get across here. Ah, nah. Don't think you can jump diagonal either. No, you can't. You can only jump um, up, down, left, and right. I missed something here. I reckon you need a double jump to get over there. You messed that up then. Oh, I jumped then as well. East, um, East 4 was a lot of grinding. A bit more grinding on there than it would have been if I'd on grinder. Literally... Every time I got to a boss, I had to grind for a bit. It weren't too bad to do in mind, to be honest, but... The only grinding I've done in this is purposely because I wanted better equipment. Just for a bit of cash. I didn't have to do it, but... It's making it a bit easier, eh? Right, so what am I missing on here, then? See, I can't jump over there. I can't go to the edge. It's probably something really sneaky I'm missing. I can't jump over there. I don't really see anywhere else to go except for... Can't go past that. There is nowhere else to go, is it? How the hell do I make that jump? No. I must be missing something.
Am I missing a double jump? What did she say? Confirm, can I say that? That's not good. The car, there's not much here to speak of. Wait. Treasure in the cave behind the waterfall. It's almost like it knows where it wants to go. to record my broadcast. Oh, what? Nerf element, okay. So I got three elements. What that makes me? Oh, right, okay. I might try that SCI out now on the mass system soon. I know RPGs are not the most riveting thing to watch, unfortunately. It'd be alright if I knew where I was going, I can get to a boss. Definitely nothing over there. It's definitely that gap I've got to get across. Let's try again. I'll try and run it this time and see what happens. Didn't even do that probably. So what am I doing wrong then? I don't think I got any equipment to help me. Magic fusion blast. It doesn't help, the magic screen's a bit knackered. I was in folks, uh, lava flow. New Christmas dressing with light. Right, so I got lava, right, okay, so. How do you change between the magics? Oh, okay, I got you. What do a lava flow does? Okay, that's pretty big. Let's 
try again. Ooh, okay. So you can fall into the water and quickly jump again. Got to be quick. Okay, we go further. Oh, now we're at it. Here we go. It's going to be a boss in yet. Are we talking? Are we cooking on gas? I know, finally. Well, that enemy wasn't too bad to deal with, as long as you could, um, as long as you use the fire magic. Oh, okay, that's ominous. Eh? Ooh, is I posted to that? I hope so, because if not, I'm screwed. Oh, you can jump back up. Okay, so what do I do here then? No moving statues or anything? Hmm. Okay. Let's try the lava for a bunch of me. Probably gonna do nothing, but... Push them or anything. I can get in there. So what, what am I supposed to do here? Hmm. Definitely, I must have to jump down here. A pattern on the floor is probably nothing. So, I'm in here then, but what do I do? I don't think I've got any items. Okay, that's um, that's going to turn into money. Don't join with free forces now. Perverse. Um. Strange fee embrace gives you but Hmm. Can't cancel that one. I mean, there anyway. Looks like steps for there, doesn't it? But so I, I'm in here, but I can't do anything. I try something. One of them to do, do a combination of buttons. It's got to be something to do with that. Hmm. 
Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. What am I missing? Don't think I missed anything on the way in. It was literally you know where to go, was it? Yeah, there's literally nowhere else I can go. So that'll drop me back down here. Just don't want to go, do I? So there's something in here, but I can't open it. You can guess this bit easy, can't you? Okay, let's try fire magic on it then. That's the wrong magic. things look like you need to step on them, don't they? Yep. Hmm. It's definitely not obvious. There's nothing in here, is it? Can't go to the sides, which it looks like you can, but oh. it's something definitely. Oh no. Something behind that, isn't it? So that opens up in the look of it. Okay, so there's nowhere to go. Still make me think I'm in the wrong place. Could look at a guide, but I don't really want to do that. Let's have to. So I can go there then. Nope. 
what is the point of going down there then? This is to jump across there. It definitely looks like there should be something there. Right, let's see if anyone says anything different now. What was I do then? Sandstorm magic. Evokes ravine magic. What the hell is that? Together. Why not? There's a do 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 do. Yeah, there's nowhere to go then. It's a weird, eh? You get all the way to that section and literally you can't... You get in there, you can't do nothing with it. There must be something I've missed. if I can get across that gap again. He said no now you can fall in the water for a second or so. Bum, 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 bum. You can go like that. That didn't work again. That's weird. Uh, it could be a while work trying to work this out. For some reason, I can't go any further. There's two places now. I can guess so far. And then that's it. Maybe I'm not supposed to go with this section now. I don't know. So west it was uh, the gorge, which I've been to. There's a cave, but there. This map gives you no idea whatsoever on how you even get to that place. No idea at all. Oh, and you definitely got to do something. It says it goes to the ruins. Odd enemies in this as well. Nothing opened up in here. No. I'm stuck a bit then. Did 
Right, you, you've definitely got to release water in here, aren't you? So sure, some idea I've got to get in there, I reckon. Even though you can walk diagonally, you can't attack diagonally. Those bits are a bit annoying so you can't see can't see where they are. Well I'm a little bit stuck. I'm sure there's one or two shoot maps on um, Mr. No Way. I'm not actually tried arcade ones on the um, Heracrestic Core. Doubt if he's gonna say anything different. He's not gonna let me in. He sells items. What if he got anything to say? Pinch all the crap in it. Nope, you can stand on it though. Worth looking around, you never know. Well, I'm stuck. Heal potion, nice. <laughs> no, nobody's changing it, all the same people. The desert ruins. See, that's what they talk about. Where the hell are the desert ruins? <laughs> so, I'm sure. That Gan thing that took all my stuff. They were on about the ruins. They said, oh yeah, meet you in the ruins or whatever. We'll get there before you. The question is, where are these said ruins? And how the hell do I get to these uh, said ruins? Because I've been to, the, been to the waterfall and the water temple, but I ain't seen no ruins. Go this way. <laughs> Dodge angst, I don't want to get poisoned. Right, I'm back to the village now, aren't I? Hmm. That is the only way I can get through by the look of it. Is that path going from the like beach area? That's like a big village through there basically. There's 
no way down. No to jump on going down. So it is literally... It says east to go to the plains, but I end up in that water... a water place. There's no way out of here, I don't think, either. Let me just go back to a town then. I'll see if I can come back to it. And over there is the waterfall. There's no way I get up there. Right, let me find the inn. That's the pub. Um, I this in. Let's go and save it a minute. Cordial adventure. <laughs> um, right, let's get out with this core, which then saves it. Let's get the mass system on, then, shall we? Let's try that SCI out. Oops. Mass system. Um, US. Mm, nope. Is it just called S? I need to sort this mass system list out. I'm sure it's missing games in certain regions. Could be wrong, mind. Um, I still can't see SAI. Special criminal investigation. Yeah, there you go. That's what's in it. Here we go, went. There's Nancy here from Chase HQ. Got gears on it. No? Have oh, you got to hold up? Oh, you have. Like old enough in these games. Well, that was not even really. it. Check about the uh, oh God Molotov setting. I guess the other button is turbo. Yeah, it is turbo. I wasted my turbos at the beginning. That was rather silly. Ooh. 
Grenade launcher. Nice. Or rocket launcher. Yeah, I could map it, but that's a good idea. I do controls uh, right, left, down, um, up. A fire one, fire two, pause, a coin. Okay, I'll do. I see you're holding up. Holding up is a bit weird. Uh, as you the old computer days, like. I should have gun, but they... Yeah, cool. Perfect. And now I'll have fun then for doing the uh, boost. Do have to remember to change it next time I play a game or something. I don't have a clue what the hell's going on. It's got the arcade level, so this is the second level on the arcade. Slow down very often, there is no break, I don't think. Oh, see, they just pull back. Right, that thing fires missiles in the arcade. Nasty. I'll have that, thank you. Do, 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 do. I'm going to boost it. Boosty, boosty. Nice then. I think that is the screen on the arcade one as well. I don't think holding up on a Mac system pad would be fun, would it? It's not here, Chase HQ. As it says on the PC Engine one. <laughs> I've got a um I've got a clone card in this. From back in the day as well. The reason I know about it, it says King on the on the front cover and uh, when i was cleaning it I, cl I was cleaning the back of the cartridge and I, I took all the print off the back of the cartridge it's actually a clone cartridge which is a bit nuts apparently there was some clone cartridges back in the day king made a few of them i, I didn't even realize until i cleaned it but, uh, what they are I think it's this. Either this or Chase HQ is one of them. Is a clone cartridge.
Oh, I'd be sneaky. It's a good time to use boost then. Oh, I thought I missed that then. Cars are definitely being sneaky now. Right, okay. I'm not gonna make it, am I? What's I am? Trapped him in between the cars. Well, that's quite nice. Definitely needs a jet bike. Yeah, I thought I'd check it out now. After I seen you play, was it yesterday you were playing? I jumped in your stream and then realised that you'd gone off. I did post hello and then I thought, hang on a minute, this, I'm catching up here. Yeah? So I felt stupid and deleted it. Up for the hill, it appears three times. Okay, get the boosty boosty for the uh, hill. What do you reckon? Cars be a pain in the ass. Ah, uh, I should have slowed down. It does. I know they're all over the place, aren't they? Bad, bad boost. I'm not going to make it. No chance of making that. No. 
There's the boost. Ah. Can I continue for me? Yes, can. Okay. Wrong button. <laughs> Oh, I wasn't far off either. I used to play the PC Engine versions quite a bit. Remember this level on the PC Engine, I watch you fall off the site. I'll get out of my way. Take a break. I think get free credits in the PC Engine one as well. Come on. And our cars are swine, they when they cross over you as well. Partner's got no face. I look like a chimp. Which <laughs> I did not decide. I look like a chimp with a blonde wig. <laughs> uh, I'm a I'm a sneaky monkey. That's quite funny. I literally look like a monkey with a blonde wig. <laughs> I never noticed that before. Little, 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 little. He does, doesn't he? Like a naughty monkey in a blonde wig. <laughs> well, that's early with the weapon. I'm gonna have to take a picture and send it to my mate, he'll laugh at her. Next time I see her. Oh that was quick that was quick. Uh, I gotta get across that road now. Damn it. I got a couple of boosts. I think I'm going to be able to get across here now. We ain't going to be. Just zoom past him. That's not good. Uh, okay. I'm going to have to boost it. Oh, come on, 16 seconds. Oh, 
Ghosties. I don't mess this up. Oh, got him. Go, Mr. Chips. <laughs> Mr. Chips. He does. I can take a picture of that. That's funny. I posted Discord now. That's 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 pretty funny. He does look like a chimp. Uh, let's have a look. Oh, I'll do it now. Hang on. That's funny. The dodgy corner. This course is a bit rough. That's really rough. I can't, oh, I can't continue on that level, can you? I can't continue on round six. Ah, oh, well. That's a bit of a shit, isn't it? I know it's a bit of a that's a bit of a shit, isn't it? Right, can I poke start? Yep, he definitely looks like a chimp with a blonde wig. <laughs> Oh man, I can't believe how funny that is. <laughs> Special chimp investigation. That's what's basically going on there. <laughs> Alright, I think give it another go in. That uh, that level's a bit rough, isn't it? Because you can't get around the bloody corners. This is Nancy here yeah, at Chimp HQ. Special order. The guy's pin pinched out bananas and peanuts. Chase after him. Otherwise, we're all starved. Okay. He's broken into a banana bank. It's quite handy, you can shoot the cars out of the way. I said, I want those peanuts back. stages. Come on, cars. 
Get an extra 90 kilometers an hour out of that. Oh, 80, 80 odd kilometers an hour. Quite easy done the first level without using boost last time. Okay, let's boost it. Boost it, boost it. See, you don't look like a chimp there. Post it on last level, I continue them, especially when you can't go fast enough to get around those corners. Can you drive off the track, maybe? Get out my way. So the helicopter turns up in the second level. That got my way. Oh, you get. That was naughty. You can't lock him in the water. Do do do. One car, get out my way. That van is hovering in midair, there. Levels done, easy enough. Or two for landslides. Cheers, Nancy. Or black, there's something. What have we got? The PC Engine one. I haven't played the PC Engine one in years. Too bad the game on the mass system, is it? It's alright. I 
forgotten what Chase HQ looks like on your mind. Oh, uh, one second. One second. Handy tactic, actually, to shoot out the way. And I boost it. Stay over. Once you got the rocket launch, you don't really want to shoot them, do you? Of course, move over as soon as I got a boost going. Close am I? I'm not far off here, I don't think. Come on. Okay, loads of cars. We've got some nice shots in there. Our car out of the way. Got it. Um, I don't know. I know the Saturn port of um, Chase HQ is a bit balked. It looks nice, but the controls are ruined. Jimpy's back. Cheers. It's nice here, Chimp HQ. Watch for hill. It appears three times. All right, so it is actually a hill, is it? It doesn't look like a hill. Public, if they're in my way, this so this is a hill. My like best. Okay, that was pretty bad. Not so nice driving on this one. Public out your way. Come 
on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Boost. I was lucky in. Come on, I'm almost there. I haven't got a boost either. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh, super lucky. I was very lucky, I won it. <sighs> you ran off on it. Let me go off the side. I've still got 30 seconds, we're okay. Oh, definitely. No, it's not a bad port, actually. Yeah, the mass system's great. It's a surprisingly good port. <laughs> BVM time. It's 19 year, Jimp HQ. Mysterious enemy. Yep. Perhaps the driver gives up. Perhaps he does put the chimp in charge. Let's turn in a suit. Come on, come on, come on, boost. Helicopter time, I get a boost. I boost. Come on, helicopter. I'm only hit so many times. I think it's like three or four. Three times for the sound of it. And a boost. Yep, three times max. Come on. 
time's getting low again. Quite close, that one. Loads of cop cars flying around here today. Thank you very much. No continues on this level though. You only get one turbo as well. I'm gonna use it at the start. It's really tricky to go around these corners. I don't think I hit it then. Doing a bad job. You can almost slow down to a crawl to get around these corners. Game over. Don't freak us going. A better score that time. All the way to the end, no continues. It's quite rough. Hey mate, how's it going? Let's try the uh, PC Engine one. I ain't played that for a long time. Let me turn the uh, scan lines off a minute. Japanese. They're under SCI or special terms. Scriminals. Scriminals. What are scriminals? Start the front screen looks practically the same, doesn't it? Um, what have we got? So basically, accelerate up. No, don't want that. I want that one. Accelerate shot. Table. Okay, that'll do. Do do. It was a very tough level. See, hope that's not tough. What is wrong? Got that. My system one's obviously this looks a lot better, but it's the same course, isn't it? Same bikers, except for there was no truck at the beginning. And no rain. You shoot the cars out the way. Yeah, we can. When they get certain so far, the, the cars go tiny, do they? Okay. Okay. Got him. It does look a lot nicer. Oh, great. It looks like a vampire. Good pointy ears and everything. I just caught Nosferatu driving in his sports car. Okay, I think he's saying. Okay, okay. 
I think. Yogurt. I think that's got it though. I used to play this quite a bit back in the day. I still quite like this game. That was lucky. You're having it. Seven bullets at your back end for that. Do 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 do. Oops. I'm gonna have to boost that. It's a bad idea. Use that bit. It's the same HUD and everything, isn't it? I wonder if um, Tato did the conversion of the ball from. Definitely fall off the track a lot easier on this one. He's not far off dead, but I've got to get back to him. The other cars are a bit more of a nightmare on this version. Yeah, the cars bump you a lot more, don't they? Well, at, least, at least your partner's got a face this time. All contenders, got a... Oh, oh, it sounds like all contenders ball to court. That's what it sounds like. All contenders... Got that. All contenders ball to court. Flying par. Yeah, the cars definitely bump you a lot more. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Okay again. They're st stupidly fast. Come on, come on. Yeah, you got water like the arcade. Okay. Get a good shot with this. Dump. Oh. He's almost dead, so. Come on, get out of my way. I'm gonna have to boost there, go on, Chase. Damn it. The, um, the computer's definitely more aggressive on this one. Yeah, it's pretty decent.
it is it, it it almost looks like the mass system or it's a conversion of this one or this is a conversion of the mass system one doesn't it oh god i wonder if the mass system is a conversion of this one but i'm pretty sure it came out in here first Okay, doesn't see that on my system, man. That's a nightmare. Yeah, computer is definitely more aggressive. It's the same mile an hour as well. 288. I think the mass system one's a conversion of this. Oh, he hit me off. Ah, oh, come on. I'm going to have to boost now, aren't I? Damn, they hit you off quite, quite easily. Oh, you bastard. I'm not going to catch him, have I? At least not in time. Tricky on this uh, bridge or whatever it is. <laughs> yeah, it looks right, sir. I figured out how to do it quite easy. Last time I looked at that in chat, it was like really complicated and you needed like a third party application you needed to run and, and that, but I looked at it again now and there's there's literally, there's some code you've got to do to get it to display and uh, the website pretty much works the code out for you. I'm dead. I can't catch him. Yes, yeah, so all you do is you, you copy the link from YouTube and then um, you copy it into a, a website you copy the link over so you see it and then you've got to copy some stuff from a website basically you, you use loads of tick boxes you tick all the options you want and then it gives you all the code for it and you just cut and paste the code makes it a lot easier i think it looks pretty decent so never go you get knocked off on that level, don't you? That's a bit of uh, get too far away from you. I'm playing Chase HQ on. I can't remember if Chase HQ on the PC Engine is not actually that great. The original version. Oh man, those trucks are nightmare.
Yeah, it looks pretty good with the chat there, I think. No, I haven't finished yet. I got a little bit stuck. I need to go back to where I do. I've got two places I can go, but I can't do anything when I get so far into them. I'm not, I'm not sure what I'm missing. I'd say watching me play events again is probably isn't the most exciting thing in the world. For everyone. Apparently that game's not that big. The fifth one on the snares. Apparently it's one of the shortest ones. Computer is really aggressive. Yeah, I might go back to it a bit later anyway. I just probably swap to something else for a change. I'm not entirely no how interested people would be watching me play in an adventure game. If you know what I mean. Don't know whether it'll get a bit boring, like. Um. He killed him as well. Oh, you never play those types you normally do. Right, okay. I could could use a guide. I'm not too bothered about that one working all out myself, to be honest. Because it, it, it doesn't really seem like um like an East game. Yeah, also maybe people would be alright with it, I don't know, but wonder a little bit if like people are not that interested in watching it. I don't know. Maybe they are. And again, you, you lot watched me play through uh, Kingsfield 2. And that took a long time. <laughs> and that's probably not the most riveting game to watch. That's tricky with the cars knocking you off. Okay, I caught up a bit of time, I think, going through there. So I got him a couple of shots. Oh, right at the end as well. Do 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 This one's definitely harder than the most system one. I got one boost. I don't want to use it be over I can easily fall off. Okay. Ooh, caught him up. Yeah, Kingsfield's quite an interesting one. A lot of <laughs> when it comes to um, swordplay. Yeah, I say I'd probably have to go something else, and I might go back to East then. It's a bit weird, though. It, it, it doesn't really feel like a weak East game. Feels more a little bit like a, a generic uh, SNES RPG. I think that's probably why it didn't do that well. Apparently it did terrible and they stopped making East games after that one for a while. I 
I'm glad they came back, of course. Some of the later games they made are really good. Lucky then, our uh, tunnel. Do 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 boost I do, but I want to get past this car first. Oh, you shit. Time's almost out. I got missiles as well. Anyway. Him nice then. Okay. Got it. Yeah, it's quite weird. You do drive for water on the arcade one though. No, I've never played these five before. It's one of the ones I, I tried a long time ago and thought, oh, this is obviously good, so I didn't bother. So it, it is literally the first time I'm playing it. That's crazy fast, that is. As soon as you get around that corner, I got a break, I think. Nope, breaking didn't help. Nightmare on you. Would have helped if I'd hit him with that, but oh well. Don't want to jinx here, but I'm definitely doing better. You just go. Oh, you hit me quite hard then. Now this is where it becomes a problem. It's catching him back up. I've got a boost, but I don't want to use it. Ah, oh, come on. Once he gets away from me, you're in trouble. Cars are a nightmare.
almost guaranteed to hit you. Come on, you can't be far away. Come on, you ain't far off dead. Hit me in the opposite direction. I'll be staying across, so hopefully you wouldn't hit me the other way around. Ah, Rainbow Road, this nest was class. Well, okay, let's have a go at the original one. I, if I remember right, the original one's not as good. Um, let's have a look. Oh, it's got a weird name on you, I can't remember. Mm, I think it has. I think it's got a different name. Uh, let's have a look. Hmm. MB Tommy Day. I'm sure it's got a different name. Question is what? Jackie Chan's quite a good game. Uh, it's definitely not too cool. Ah, oh, God, what is the other name for it? Did it come out in the US? No. That means I need to find the name for it. Oh, game series collection. Hang on, I wonder if I can find it in your recent or recent games. Special Criminals Investigation. Tato Chase HQ. Right, okay. I remember seeing this in the magazines back in the day and I thought, oh, it looked amazing. This is Nancy at Safe Headquarters. We've got an emergency here. It's the speech is better on this one. That's got pretty good. You, Nancy. I got you, Nancy. It's definitely faster. Actually, it's not look too bad. Yeah, I forgot this. When the road splits, then you've got to take the right way up, which takes longer. Sign up. This would be really like a game in the arcades. The original arcade version is really good. to push today. Dead. Oh, 
I think this was a reasonably early PC Engine game as well. As a French campsite was here, that's bad. Yeah, the arcade's great, isn't it? Oh, as soon as I catch him up. Do a very good job that first level. We never been to France once. Yeah, I I originally seen it in the stand up cab. Anyone ever played uh, JC Two Free? Sit down one. It looks cheap, JC Two Free, but it's quite good. We've got an emergency here. No, I don't. I have played the sit down cab, but uh, Jamie was the stand up cab. Got you, Nancy. Got you, Nancy. Yeah, Chase's Q3 is quite good. I can't remember the full name of it now, but um, like I say, it, it doesn't look the best, but uh, it's pretty fun to play. The proper 3D one it is. With, oh, I think it's 3D. I oh, had yeah, a PCB already. Nice. It looks like. Um, you know, PlayStation sort of uh, 3D, a little bit better than mine, but it's that type of 3D. Solid. Dead. I played it in a few places. You got it in an arcade club. Last time I went. It runs a lot faster, isn't it? Ah, man. It's hard work to get to the cars. Get to him again. Yeah, if he's still got it there, I'll, I'll, I'll do some. Ah, game over. I haven't booked that yet either. I need to sort that out because uh, just not going to be able to get tickets otherwise. <laughs>
Right, okay, cool. That's fun. Rubber racing games on the PC Engine. So that's that's the motorbike racing game I was used to call Teodo Motorbike Racing. These are good, but they're really, really fast. Final lap, twin. It's alright. Night Rider Special is not as bad as it 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 looks. I don't mind Motor Rider. Where's Motor Rider 2 then? I'm Motor Rider 3. Okay, so there's more that there's definitely missed out of the game here. That one's quite good. Power Drift is quite good. Cheesy, but... Chase its kill. Victory run. Let's try... Okay. I go for sadism here. Here we go. These games are they're good, but they're really hard. They're like super fast. Do 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 do. Why does she turn fat when you press the button? Uh, who should we go for? I'm not going to do them. Go for Jordan then. <laughs> I'm just hot. Uh, okay. Let's go for France. Go do the British one. Belgium is quite good. Spanish one's quite good. Japan, Germany, Distributu. Oh, they made this thing. Let's have a, let's have a free run. These, these games are insane. I finished the Mega Drive version of this, but I've never finished the PC Engine ones. Because they're superly fast. As you can see. And twitchy. Very hard to come first on. I remember it took me ages to finish the Mega Drive one. You have pretty fast reactions with these games. What happens if I try to do it without slowing down? Which you probably can do. So the yellow corners I can definitely get around without slowing down to a certain degree. Solid. I think they did three or four of these on the PC Engine. One of them is on CD. I like top-down racing games. This type, I do quite like them, but they're not easy to play. Was a bit of a crash end, eh? Yeah, 
Yeah, Japanese didn't give a shit, did he, when it came to copyright stuff? <laughs> Not quite as bad as the Chinese mind, but they, they didn't care. It's only when they started releasing their games in the West, they thought, Ooh, hang on a minute. Perhaps we might need to change that. Don't, don't fancy getting sued. Oops. Alright, that's a free run. Right, okay. Let's do, um... Do the practice run and then, uh... Go for handling. <laughs> Good start, day. God, this thing is definitely better at handling. That's good. get into these games, you just got to have reactions like a ninja. Damn. I think don't uh, slow down and skid. You got to slow down then turn. But again, you start breaking. When you hold it down, you end up skidding. I think his lap is terrible, but I think it's better than the first one. Oh. Oh god, that was a bad corner. Yep, it's definitely better than the first one. Let's see if I can do better again. Get in. Ooh, bugger. Hard to stay on the track. Very, very difficult. I think I've still got the Japanese Mega Drive version of this. I think it's based off 91, I think. Okay, can I go on my... Let's go on my just over a minute lap. See what that gets me. Last place. bad so far. I'm on a way off the pace. Look at that. 41. <laughs> I'm gonna be lost. Yep, nowhere near. Am 
max speed. We have to go find it again, eh? I think this must have been quite a popular, um, popular sort of series of games. Maybe we should ease off the accelerator instead of rolling it down then breaking. Yeah, that's better. God, I'm all over the place. Oh, it wasn't it wasn't uh, clean but definitely faster well that's a much better lap pretty fast these games aren't they when you get into them It is not easy to stay on the road. Oh, it's my best lab yet. Right, let's go with that. See where that gets me. Twentieth. Shit, you gotta be loads faster again. That's over ten seconds. I got twelve. That's twelve seconds faster. That's it. That got rid of me. <laughs> Those games take uh, take a while to get into. Good though, once you do. Um, okay, let's try. I don't know why he hasn't got the other motor routers. This one came out on the Switch and the PlayStation not long ago. They're really tough, aren't they? They're good though. I, I like them, but they take they take a lot of practice. Yeah, this one got a switch release about when they got Christmas time, maybe I think it was. Maybe just after. And it's on the PS4. This is like completely different to the other motor order games. It's quite fun. What options we got. Uh okay, I don't know where any of that is. We'll just go with that. Player one. This is like sprint, top down. Sprints are quite cool arcade game as well, isn't it? The free steering wheels. It's quite a good old arcade game. shortcuts sometimes you can take um, you almost lap me last seems a bit of a female doesn't it um motor road one is not a bad game but road two is a lot better 
even with the bouncing you around. Uh, Motor order freeze, even nicer again. If you like this type of game, like, you know me. I'm not sure whether the... It's not a remake, actually. It's just a plain port. I don't know whether it's online on the, the one they released. It'd be fun if it was. I can imagine five players online on this could be actually pretty fun. That would be a really good feature if they bring out a mister. I wonder if they could ever do that online play. I bet somebody thought about it. computer to finish off is. Yeah, I used to like Motor Road 2 quite a bit. It's a, it is a better game than the second one. A bit more sort of like um, space-themed in some way. Yeah, it is. I, d I do like top-down racing games. I've always, I was like them. There was an arcade one called Tail to Nose, which was rock hard, but it was, I really liked that. Can't remember who made it. Come on, ah, oh, I lost out then. Motor road, you've got to change your controls, I'm new, because the, the initial control setup is weird. Oh, that was nice. I did just jump down my neck. That way. Hope not. Eight spiders. Look, interesting creatures. Don't like pick them up though. Like I'm the only one at work that uh, checked the laptop. Uh, it was actually checked the laptop out through the window. And I was picking up a spider. Yeah, micro machines. I, I I never really got into, even though Motor Roader is essentially like a prequel to it. I remember when it came out. Tried to get into it, just I don't know. I played it for a while. I don't mind it, but I never really got mastery into it like some people did. It was popular though, wasn't it? I think I've played the first one quite a bit, then I'll bother playing the sequels. I've had them on the Mega Drive, the sequels, a few times, but... I don't know. 
don't know what I did then. Four. New drift out is fun. Yeah, I like that. Which one do I have on New Mega? Is that a micro machines? Was it? Ah, right. Okay. Yeah, it was on everything, wasn't it? But it was it was pretty big back in the day. That was when it came out. I say I played the first one quite a bit, and then uh, I never bothered the ones after it. I don't know why. You mean you have two play on? I don't even know. A really a game that's that fun on your own. Played on the CDI as well, it's pretty bad. I think it was the CDI. So I have a CDI free deal. Damn. You shot me then. So you can fire on this, you tap the forward drive button. Last phase. Yeah, I think it might be the spider. Felt like it. Nah. Should go looking for it actually, because if it is a spider in this, it's going to die. I taught them quite well. If they come in here, this game over. I think this, this room must like reek of spider death. There's probably loads of them in here though. Mother on the other hand, she loves them. Let's have a look. Am I spider infested? That's the question. Let's have a look. That's what it felt like anyway. I can't see what. We scuttled off somewhere. That game over. Do 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 do. Gotta change that. It's taking too long, isn't it? Man, I've seen it for ages. Hang on a minute. Let me go back. I have set that so it only it only just pops up quickly. So you can set it. You can FTP into it, but do from the any file. I think the standard time is like thirty seconds, which is way too long. Ah, right, okay, where are we? Where is it? Refresh, power menu, no. Why am I in 720p? Uh -huh. Is on the right... Uh... Strange. Normally gives you more options that for um, resolution. I shouldn't be in 720p, I should be in uh, 10e. E scale, yeah, match frequency, that's okay. Should be on low lag anyway, because I changed that. Maybe it didn't stick. Normally gives you free options for resolution. Save scale screen to height. Mag. Oh, I support VR, VR now, do you? do do direct video, no, no. E scale, no. There's normally the option to change that uh, setting as well. Uh, more options, here we go. OST timeout, video info timeout, that's the one I want. 
30 seconds is fine. Wonder why it uh, had me in compatibility mode, even though I changed it back. Scale the fit. 1080p scale the fit. May mess. Shouldn't mess up the uh, stream, but if it does, I'll have to just adjust it. Um, let's have a look. They've added some more options. The VRR stuff, I've never seen that before. FB terminal, no, I don't want to turn that on. Visual control, not set. Control info, leave that off. What is that? Come on. Have you seen the controller info? Check it on, never even seen it. Oh, I know what that is. I know what that is, that's the one that pops up in the corner. Make sure I turn that off. Yeah, it does. It's 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 cool if you've got the option if you've got you know if you've got a TV or monitor that supports it, but it's a bit of a shit if uh, you know game designers uh, are basically giving you that option because they can't program their games correctly to run smooth. You know that's that, that can't be used as an excuse for shitty frame rates, can it? Reset combo. Or timeout, boot control, set command. Okay, let me save that. Yeah, exactly. It's it isn't really when when it's used as um, you know just a way to keep your smooth framers because I can't run the game properly. Yeah, that's a problem. I noticed something the other night. I know it sounds a bit stupid. The glass on the front of this screen is like it's got a it's got a haze to it. You can't see it when you're playing, but it, it obviously cuts down on glare. And if you look at the lights I've got in the ceiling and the haze that comes off the lights, that's exactly what my cat racks used to look like. It is practically exactly the same. Right. Okay. Let's try again. One more go of it, and I think I'll go back to um, I'll go back to Visa. Uh, where is it? Motoroda, yeah, it's a, it's a nice tool in your arsenal, isn't it? Um, VLR, if you've got the ability to do it, but you know, it shouldn't be expected if you are. It is, yeah. It's definitely. It, it basically, what happens is, because you're on a 60 hertz screen, and as soon as you run under your 59.94 hertz, you can get screen tearing and stuff, and um, you get in, in, and you can use like uh, you can get imperfection, uh, your frame timings wrong and things like that, and or you can get drop in frames, so you could basically drop, say you drop down from. Um, I know 60 frames a second when you hit something in game or you do something and it drops down to like 45 so then you get that terrible drop in frame which looks awful on screen and you get the screen tear and everything that goes with it but vrr will be basically your screen will adjust it's like an old crt almost it will adjust its its um its frequency to the frequency of the game so it, it pretty much it, it eliminates those screen tearing and frame drops it looks smooth basically so like an old like an old CRT does, you get frame drops uh, drops on a CRT. You don't really notice it. It's a CRT like will drop its refresh rate to compensate for it because they have unlimited refresh rate essentially, isn't it? or to a certain degree anyway. So it is definitely beneficial and a nice little tool to have, but. It shouldn't be, it shouldn't be, 
it shouldn't be used as an excuse for crappy frame rate. I'll just use VRR. Unless you've got a you know a pretty nice PC monitor or um, like an OLED TV or something, you're not going to have it. Well, this course is a lot harder. my way in. Yeah, it, it apparently, I, I haven't seen it myself, but uh, apparently it makes quite a big difference because essentially you don't get those frame drops or those, in the, you know, when you get frame pacings wrong, you don't get that problem. It smooths it out. So, but it, it can, it only can go down so far. I'm not sure if something like 38 frames is the limit or is that 45 or 38 is the limit of what it can actually do yes so those frame drops in FromSoft as long as they don't go and uh, say it's 45 for instance as long as they don't go into 45 frames um, it won't look like they drop it looks smooth with no drops My ass kicked on this one. So it, it's a really nice feature, eh? but yeah, it shouldn't, it shouldn't be used as an excuse for poor programming. Or they can just use VR to, you know, to bloody clear it up. I think doing that's a bit shitty. And that that seems to be happening as well. With a lot of new games, people just say, "Oh, if you use VR, you know, you can, you can sort that out." But that shouldn't be the case, really, should it? You know, developers should op optimize their games a lot better. I know, I know, it's easy for me to say that, but at the end of the day, you pay money for it, and when you're paying like sixty quid or seventy quid or whatever for a game, you expect it to be made, made properly and well optimized. That's a bit of a shit when it isn't. Where are you feeling? How's it going? Yeah, I haven't actually seen it myself, but um, I know what it does like. Yeah, I can imagine it makes a really nice difference. You'll be lucky, like, if you've got the consoles, you're not going to get any of those frame drops. Yeah, I just noticed that the mist is added in now as well. I suppose you're not really getting that many drops on the mister, but yeah, I can see where it would be useful. I bet if you play something like, um, all right, it, it's not the magical thing that gets rid of everything, because like I said, there is a limit to it in VR. Like I said, I can't remember if ever it's something like 45 frames or 38 frames is the limit of what it can actually uh, fix, essentially. Something like that. Yeah, it's not going to do anything for capturing, is it? Because you're still stuck. If you're capturing stuff, you're still stuck with the frame drops, and your capture card's gonna gonna read those frame drops in it, basically. All right, okay. Yeah, that, that's cool. Yeah, definitely use uh, game mode if you can. Yeah, VRR and game mode as well. That's that's perfect. That gives you some of the best options, doesn't it? <laughs> 
Is your is your CX the one that does 120 frames? I know you're sacrificing resolution and quality for it, but 120 frames is definitely smooth. It's not 120 frames. I'd say it's not as big jump it is from 60 to uh, some 30 to 60, but it, it's definitely smoother. You can definitely see it. It does look a lot smoother. A 30 to 60 is definitely uh, quite a big difference. I think because 60 is pretty smooth, anyways, it's not. It's not quite so noticeable, if you know what I mean. It's not. Maybe not noticeable, but more jarring. But it is definitely. I've only tried it on my phone, and. When you when you play stuff at uh, 120 on the phone, it is definitely smoother. I've never seen the original Doom look so smooth. Put it that way. Maybe I'll have an OLED one day. Could have bought an OLED instead of the cab, but I think I'd have more fun with the cab. <laughs> Boosts are quite handy. You can just drive into them. Ooh. Is it the um, yeah the CX? That's one twenty, doesn't it? I'd like to see that on the CX, I've got to be honest. I will say though, the 60 is still nice and smooth, but... More the merrier, I suppose. Line line 60 FPS definitely does the job. I had to think of not all old retro games were 60 hertz. I need to think of last. This game is really difficult. Right, I'm going to go and grab another drink. And have a tinkle. Five seconds is still a long time, isn't it? Right, okay, let me adjust that once more and I'll go and grab a drink in. I think I'll knock it down to two seconds. And then again, I may as well just turn it off. <laughs> using a PC on your screen or using a console? They were mostly 60, but they, there is a lot of them. Well, not a lot of them. There is, there is a, there is, there is a few of them that are, are less. Tasmania on the Meg Drive 30. Um, Outrun Arcade is 30. Even though you wouldn't notice it, it looks smooth. There's others as well. I suppose on a on a CRT, thirty doesn't look that bad. In fact, thirty looks alright on the CRT. Right, I'm gonna go and uh, grab a drink a second, and we'll be back in a mo.
Hello, I'm back. Oh, the PlayStation Core. Um, I'm not sure either, to be honest. I'm new got a set a memory card. I can't remember if you had to set a memory card per game. I remember reading something about that. I don't know why mine doesn't pop up with them anyway anymore, but uh Save memory card. Yeah, you can do that. Save um to SD card and open OS. No, I didn't do anything. Yeah, you've got a mountain memory card. Haven't you got to have a memory card file, if I remember rightly? Remember rightly, there's a memory card file you've got to put in um, in the folder with it. Yeah, save states uh, to SD card on. Oh, so you can do save states anyway. I don't know whether that works in everything, mind. Go to PAL. Yeah, I'm sure if I remember there was a memory card file you had to add. I wish I could figure out why I don't get the PlayStation logo anymore. I've probably done something in here and turned it off. 6V blank. Save and no. Don't know, I've turned it off somewhere. Maybe because I put fast boot on, maybe. Check that on, definitely. Yeah, I don't know. I'll say if you stuck, if you want to join, the, if you need that file, I can always, uh, if you join the Discord, I can always send it to you. I can always post it up on there. I'm pretty sure there was a SD um a memory card file you had to check in there. At least you did originally when the um the call first came out when it was on beta. <laughs> right, okay. Translations. I see if I can figure out what the hell I'm doing wrong in this. Falcom presents. It's weird. I, I think Falcom, they didn't do East 4 on the consoles. I, I think they farmed it out to another company to do. Which is a bit strange. Maybe they licensed it out. in the lost kingdom of sand. <laughs> right, here we go in. Right, so I'm stuck basically. Uh, I've had a large acquisition to the north, but it's uh, of amazing equipment. I'm stuck. You're going into the jungle, you need a whole lot of, uh... He mentions about going into the jungle? <laughs> yeah, that outrun at 30 frames a second, it doesn't look like it's 30, does it? Missing something somewhere. Um, Ooh, what's that? Police restores 
It's quite expensive as well. <laughs> Don't need that. So where, where am I going wrong at? <laughs> ah, there's the Bruins. To the east of the Zelle Bruins. That is where I've got to go, I think. We have items coming from the ruins available for sale. I just keep shop. <laughs> have I got to open that shop in to get something? Maybe I'm missing something from the shop. I'm probably going to pop out tomorrow. Um, I'm out Saturday then in a wedding all day. And so I won't be on Saturday. And I'm watching Evo on Sunday. But I plan to do Monday. Or at least I'll sort of get those two days in over the weekend. <laughs> so that's the plan. I plan to stream on Monday. As long as I'm not ruined after staying up for watching uh, Evo. <laughs> it should be alright. Yeah, I got a busy weekend this week, so... I expect I'll, if I, if I don't go out tomorrow, I'll be on, but I, I expect I'll, I normally pop out for quite a while, but I might just pop down for a few hours and then come back. Still pop out, but just come back earlier. I don't normally come back till about, I don't know, three o'clock in the morning on a Friday. So I plan I'll, I'll have to come back about half twelve. At least get enough sleep in then for it. sorting out Saturday. No, it's one of my uh, mates which I've known since school. He's uh, getting married. I've known him since he was about, I don't know, probably about 13, something like that. I wish I could figure out what, what do I need to do here. Obviously, I need to let water in you somehow. The trick is, how? What? I can't quite work out what I'm actually missing. There's one minute I was supposed to be going on this stag do, but I, I skipped it because of... Uh, Covid, which I didn't really want to do, but I did. But oh, sorry, I can't skip a wedding. <laughs> no. That'd be funny if it was. No, you definitely won't be in a horse or carriage. <clears throat> See, I'm, I'm stuck here now. I don't really know where to go. I can't do anything there, and I can't do anything in the in the waterfall either. Because that way goes back through the forest, which I've already been through.
Yeah, I could do game facts. I don't know if I want to though, but then maybe maybe I will just uh, figure out where I've got to do and where I'm going wrong. This is a bit. This one especially. It, it, this doesn't hold your hand at all in what you, what you have to do. It took me ages to do the first bit of the game. Because I had to look on a poster on the wall. Which I didn't even know you could click on it. I ran around for ages on the first bit trying to figure out what the hell was going on. Poison me. Yeah, this is supposed to be um, a short game as well. I don't know much how far I'm through it, but apparently it's not very big. into the waterfall. I can get in the cave on the waterfall, but... See, these guys in here don't really say much. Buy items. What's he got for sale there? Oh, okay. Nothing interesting. So you can talk to her. It's not where you can. There's not much here to speak of. Wait. Yeah, well, I've got to the cave. There's a treasure in there, but... I managed to get in the cave, but I don't know what you do when you get in there. Work your way up here. I'm not sure how I got over this gap though. I did jump in the water, so I'm not sure how I got around it. You gotta power up your magic there. Yeah, this one's a bit. It is a bit vague, to be honest. But somehow I jumped in that water and then I went across. Actually fell in the water and went across. That was a pain in the ass, that bit is. I'm going to be fair. Oh, I know. So no one's saying anything up here, and I can't. I can't do anything when I get in the cave. So I'm assuming I need something. I can't get in the. I can't do anything in the water. In the, uh, the bit looks like water should flow through it. And everyone in the town is not mentioning. Just notice something. Yeah. Okay, just double checking. Yeah. Everyone has mentioned about going to um, the desert. Use that as well. 
Sí. Ja, ich, ich, ich bin jetzt. When I first came in there, there was a guy on, the, on his back there. Asked me for some cash, so I give him some cash. And then there's these like thieves and pinch of stuff I've got earlier in the game. And they, they run off up here and said, Oh, we'll get there, we'll get to the um the place before you do. And then they run this way. Oh, but, oh you gotta go this way, haven't you? No. Not guess who's in. It says take us past the desert all the way back to the first part of the town. So I don't know what to do. Not very clear. Oh, bollocks to it. Let's have a look. <laughs> I'm gonna be running around you forever, boys. Yeah, let's see if I can find something. It's an hour and 45, is it? Right, okay. So it can be done pretty fast then. Oh, I found a guy here now. I don't know everything. Just be nice to know. Let's have a look. Forest. I found forest. Please note that you can search the house in the northern part of the village. Hmm. I think I've, I must have got reasonably far through it. Second is. Uh, Forest cave. Have I got to that? Marina. This thing you notice is there are rocks dropping from rocks dropping from the ceiling. Okay. Um. What's your first exercise in jumping? Maybe I have missed something in the forest, I don't know. Right, I know that bit. Let's just take it out of the cave, I think I did that bit. The turtle like it should, right, okay. Forest revisited? Another town. It looks like you've got to revisit a few places by the look of this. Yeah, it looks like you've got to go back and forth quite a bit. Doesn't really give you a clue. Cabin, no. I'm trying to work out where I am. Southward. Uh, okay, let's have a look where this is. So you went to the forest, the enemies here are pretty much the same. Near the end of the path, you will uh, see two men and a little girl. Right, okay, I've did that. I know where that is. I did that. They're the ones that pinch my stuff. Right, okay, I've done that. Northward. This is in the same place. The area is pretty linear, just follow the paths of the first. First screen after that, meet up with uh, Rod. Uh, we got hurt, yeah, I remember doing that bit, that's a bit where the boss was. We've done that. Now, you know, rubbing magic beans, it solves everything, doesn't it? I haven't picked up any beans though. Bridges, swamplands, bridges. Elsewhere, most of them are broken through. Yeah, I've did that. I've done the swampland. Okay. It's awkward on the phone, isn't it? Trying to work out where you've been. Needles Cavern. Which encounter the foes in there is evil as well. 
Large flying bats, yeah, I've done the bats. The split, yeah, I've done that. Okay, I've done that. Why don't you make it back to the car, you can... Talk to Rod, he loves Rod, he's great. Looks like I've got quite far through this guide, but look there. Sad brooms, ah, another switch. Broom. Uh, take on the screen. Next thing. The enter, enter the ruins. Um, this place, like the swamplands, counts on counts as a dungeon, so you won't be able to. Uh, help me. Uh, difficulty. Go west again for the next screen. Here you actually get to a switch hidden. I'm not sure if I've done this bit. Yeah, it, it it doesn't really. Think about this. It does. It doesn't really give you a clue. That's that's the, that's the problem. Usually you can work it out, can't you? It's usually some sort of clue to go here or go there. But this this is not really giving me any idea where where I could go in. Like I said, it 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 bombed in Japan quite badly, apparently. Probably because it wasn't very good. Here we go out, uh, following the path. I'm not sure if I've done that, see? Mm. No, it'd be nice if there was one, but there isn't one in this. Open the gate by blocking the water. Yes, I'll look what's this here. I'm not sure what these places are called to you, it just doesn't help. Right, air raid or storm zones left. We'll be able to pass through proceed very far into this server until you've spoken to right, okay. So you say you won't be able to proceed very far into these ruins. Into the Seb ruins until you've spoken to a Masara in one of the houses along the riverfront. It's directly left of the magic shop. Go dig up a go and dig up a key. I don't even know if I'm in the right place here. Hmm. Go back to this place. Let's look at that. I just have to run round again. That's good way telling you to. Information. Feel charged. Right. I am definitely haven't done that bit. I don't remember being charged 500 by a woman. Or oh, did I pay someone 500? I might have. Back in the place you first saw him. Take the eastern exit to go before. Rounds of fields. Note be the new versions of the bugs that look like the flowers. Destiny upon and my attacks. But they do quite a good bit of damage. Shouldn't be out in there. Tell us to still use the lever armor. No. Reading should be a good idea. Mm, I don't think I'm there yet, see? Wait a minute. Where am I? What is this place? Ramsen. Oh, hang on. Ramsen City, right? Okay, this is where I am. Meet you and enter you know, an old woman will ask you to uh, tell. Right, okay, that's the ones that ripped me off. I thought it was a guy, not a woman. Okay. I'll take uh, This is where I am. This is what I did. 
Anyway, if you talk to uh, the same bruins a bit, then leave. Turns out it's one of the evil go. One of the go fig gan. One of the evil gan, okay. Shops. What do you do here? Be sure to pick up the selective remedy if you can afford it. Check between the two shop buildings uh, for the wind elemental. For the northern corner, the first section of the town is a fire emblem. In the northern section of the town, uh, the river, check the boxes on the left. The healing potion. Okay. We're almost here. Oh, Papa Lazarou should know. Knows everything. Yeah, Papa Lazarou. Papa Lazarou is quite freaky. Let's see if we go far. Yeah, there's some portion of the screen. Talk about this. Talk about Seb Ruins. It's a bound in the city. Um, you get quite a. Beautiful. Everyone will pay attention to the books in the library. Hang on, I remember the books in the library. One of them details how to separate... Oh. Here we go. The books in the library. Hello. I'm still here. Hello, Dai. You're my wife now. Um, I've seen the books in the library and I couldn't be arsed reading them. I think you have got to read them. One of them tells you how to do the... Oh, no, I'll be asked because of this much of the knowledge. Perhaps I should have read the books. Uh, went to Archimedes for the source of power which gave prosperity to all people. It was the primary source of power 500 years ago in the kingdom of Kevin. Yeah, I wonder if his cookbook is here. It might be. The crystal shards will hold the power of the six elements. Ah, oh, they're light, water, fire, earth, wind, and darkness. The shards are simply referred to as the elements. If you use the elements, you can release great power. This elements are fused, so these other stones can be used as power source. And the flusk. Flux. Look at flus. I don't know, I can't even say. Fluff stones. Uh, the fluffy stones, we'll cover that. Can we affix to the sword? Affix? I oh, guess it's blue out. I, I've already done that. To the west is a dense forest, yeah. While Zeb ruins lie to the east, I yeah. To the north lies the gorge, which leads to the waterfall, yeah. Creatures living beyond the gorge are far stronger than seems to be careful. Okay. Okay, Travis, let's save Travis. Potions are messed along with. Try to make sure you burn out the toast as well. Okay, that's a nice tip. That could be anything interesting at the moment, though. Ah, you are. You need a floodgate key to open the channel. Inside there is a switch to drain the waterfall, which is I need to get into. Once drained, the waterfall itself can be used as a read. Ah, right, okay, a road to your destination. Right, okay, so that drains the waterfall in there. So I need a key. Part of the north is the jungle, which is mostly unexplored. Use for crystals is there, most of which are venomous and very dangerous. I hope that's not in there. I've known to go to the nations as ever said to have the strongest warriors alive. Eventually, invaded by caffeine with slot, uh, sort of riches and fertile soil. The other caffeine strength can be crushed. No, it's the tale of the Red Age. Yeah, okay. That's the only book I read was this one. Okay, so where do I get a key from? Okay, so I read that. I need a key. Check as everyone's right. I'll find the library to study. All oh, right, so that is that is how to do it then. It tells you over there. Mental notes. That's what I'm putting in there. Ah, 
so now, once you've read that, he gives you the extra options. So you plan to go into the ruins where you don't have the flood key yet. The Garmin, he... Garnum, or whatever his name. He lives in north of here. It is... Right, okay. I don't know if I've collected pretty much anything. Right, so I gotta go north then to get a key. I'm gonna go into ruins, we don't have a key. Went to know if should talk to uh Garden. Lives in the north here. Um, yeah, okay. Alright, okay. Didn't want to do that. So I'm not too overly bothered about playing this one because it's okay. But it's got to be done because I want to complete them all. The same as I'm going to I'm gonna have to do um, Turrican 2 one day as well. I don't know if you have a Turrican game apart from Turrican 2. Any problem is I don't like it. It's easy just to walk past these. Yeah, I know. I couldn't be asked reading the books. Maybe that was uh, that was my uh, my downfall, really, wasn't it? I, I've I've won credit on the Amiga, on the first one, on the Mega Drive, and Turrican Three and all them. Just not Turrican Two and the SNES, because it's just not very good. It's the only one I don't like that much. Right, okay. Said some guy lives in the north. Well, this is definitely north. Even Universal Soldier on the Meg Drive, don't I as well? It's not actually that bad. Right, does she tell me? Right, so I don't remember any house up here once you get past this. So this must be the wrong way. I think that cave I got to, I must have got it when I shouldn't have. And managed to accidentally jump across the gap where I shouldn't have been able to. I think that's... That's why I couldn't do anything there. Yeah, I haven't done the PC Engine one. It's not great on the PC Engine. Uh, I like balls, but for Derrigan, but it's not great. The first tokens are like great anyway. I've done it on the Mega Drive. Maybe I should try the PC Engine. Right, so we said north. I right, did he mean north of the town? Yeah, it's, it's not the best.
This is Gotham, then. Oh, it's like, I said, I can't remember how I played it for ages. Alright, he says something about it. Alright, let's talk to somebody else this time. Masa. Masa. Masara. Please go, to, go in back and talk to Masara. There's another key, just... The other guy told me to go north. All oh, right. Okay. That was a bit of put off, wasn't it? So, I think that cave I got to in the waterfall, I shouldn't have got there. I think I got there by accident. I must have found a glitch to get over that water. As I actually fell into the water and managed to jump back out to it before it took me down. I'll have to give it another try in the PC Engine. Looks like it. I've already said he holds his farts in his hand. <laughs> This is not good. So I think I got the key now. Yay! Okay, I can do something. That was a palaver. See, if I could have bothered reading, which I couldn't be asked, maybe I would have figured this out. Goddamn reading. I read uh, one of the books, I thought, oh, it's just, it's just the usual sort of history thing. Right, okay, let's see if I can open that door and see what it does. So I bet you drain the water from the waterfall, which then allows you to get over that gap that I accidentally got over. Oh, talk about do a bad job of it in this. Because uh... I think I got across there by accident. So you can't sequ sequence break this game then. I always tell everyone I ain't read no books unless I've got pictures. I have read I have read a few books. I'm not really into reading books of mine to be honest, but I have read few. I read five necroscope books. Uh, almost finished Lord of the Rings, so it's a bit boring. Uh, I read two I think it was the Colour of Magic and I can't remember the other one. Um what else I read? I read the Bible once. Only because I had pictures. And I was, I was probably about 10 at the time. Ah, I tell, have you seen that pop-up Sega book you can get? With a pop-up um, hang-on cabinet and stuff. I quite like to have that. I've read that many, you know, proper books. Like I've read a few. Are they? Yeah, fair enough. Like, I just, I, I'm not dialing into reading actual books. I end up reading lots of stuff by reading magazines or reading web pages, but not generally reading books. Like I said, I was telling one, unless I got pictures, I'm not interested. <laughs> I 
My favourite books are definitely the Necroscope books, I mean. I enjoy them. I got I got a few books here as well. I, I gotta do that one, I'm like. But at least we're getting some, you know. Yeah, they're probably quite interested in the rock band stuff. It's a sticky one, I was. Ah, uh, you said about Stephen King's before. Yeah, I've just never really been into reading books. I was always into reading magazines and stuff. I don't I just... Probably because they interested me a little bit more, I think. That's out, isn't it? I was, I was always into reading magazines. I read magazines all the time. Now we're getting some in. So I read that PC Engine book. That was the last book I read. I read through all that, that was good. I should read the Neo Geo ones I've got. Oh, is that a raft? Yeah, it is. Ah, I bet you get on that. Down here. Yeah, you do. Yeah, if I, if I was... If I was doing stuff like that, I would... Oh, I probably need to get off here, don't I? I'll just, like, um... Okay, messed that up. I'll sit there and read stuff on my phone, like, so... You know, I suppose, I... at that point, I suppose I may as read a book. To me, like I just prefer, I just prefer films to books, if you know what I mean. It's got, I, I got quite a few game books here. I need to read. I started reading the um, the untold story of uh, Japanese developers. I got that book. I read, I read quite a bit through there. I got. Quite a few stuff here actually I should actually get off my lazy ass and actually read it. Yeah, but that's quite interesting the unreleased games one. Okay. Again, eh? But this is definitely a little bit more interesting now because uh, we are definitely finding stuff to do. The dungeons in, in this are not overly hard. This is probably the most complicated one I've come across so far. Find a proper use for magic yet. Mm. 
Yeah, this is the biggest dungeon I've come across yet. Don't seem to get that interesting stuff from um, chests in it. Right, okay, I'll go in here before opening that door. No, maybe I won't. What have we found? Water element? Okay. Yeah, not lost anymore. Right, I definitely can't get up there. But I walked on it. The graphics are a little bit weird though, sometimes, so you can't quite tell if it's a higher level or not. So again, let's go to crystals for cash. trick is, how do I get in there? Actually, I did get rid of those pillars, didn't I? Probably going the wrong way, but yeah. That's the way I came in. I'm definitely going the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, no worries, buddy. You're off you. It'll be Monday. No worries, but cheers for popping in. Cheers for the chat and stuff, as always. Let's go. Uh, have I got to do a jumping puzzle? Yeah, I got to do a jumping thing there. Jump it down. Cheers, mate. Night night. <laughs> ah, right, okay, that brings me back here. <clears throat> Question is, why does this bring me back? Ooh, what's he doing? He's fast. He's fast a little bugger than he. Duty to fulfill. This means I stay right here. Come on, don't be like that. It's more niche of those Schreiber Cafe, and that's where I left now is the old ruins. And even survive the rock piles and tiles, where they're still standing. Okay. 
It's not very friendly. We'll find it guarded by a truly fierce beast. Beast of fire. Either way, whatever power is it destroyed the deep. Here we go, Sammy. I've nothing to put myself a wish to share with you. Okay. Friendly. That's how we get you. Okay, glitch. It's a bit weird then. This is not a particularly hard East game. Oh, the power ring. Boss dragon? Sneaky. Got him. The old snatch slow down. idea doing that then, but... Ooh, slow down city. I gotta heal things if I need it. I bet I can get up that waterfall now and get to that bit which I shouldn't have got to. Happy days. That's who he's just hanging around for. How old's he here? If his, pass his father's been passed away for generations. How old's that guy? Okay. 
Hey, progress. <laughs> Wasn't expecting you to come to his person. Yeah, I expected you to uh, hear about the car we have been taking to Alexander and Andrea. Uh, I'll perhaps I said the redhead. Oh, I dodged the event. The moment I have agreed to come be with you. However, once the crystal doors have been gathered, who knows what happens then? To my intention, she said earlier. Yeah, it's got some like it. Open away to the Phantom City, precisely. All about getting to that Phantom City. whole screens it, it well I changed the colour of them actually they were blue they look like Final Fantasy ones you're going to waste the to complete your preparations yes my dear you live up to your end of the deal we trust is Andrea you're good quickly enough I'm working for the dodgy guy. A chance to relax in my own home. By the time I've been waiting for a few o'clock ages, you might find yourself strange. Just a disaster once a week. And uh, what's happened now? Never tell says the nation of Zeb wiped out by the Kefarians. Kefnian, sorry. Both these legends seem to be ornated around the same time. Start. You're doing, after all, you have a few crystals already. Give me a moment of Oh. It's cool, we made a little bit of uh, progress. Oh, we'll begin. Let's give it to one who appeared bearing the crystals. Do my search for the Phantom City. I've been researching the history of the crystals. Very nice. Soon we'll be heading north. In hopes of finally finding the Terror Crystal. The research has shown that the crystals have been spread throughout the desert to the east. If you solve the mystery of these things, perhaps. Uh, we'll finally find the Phantom City. So I can uncover their significance, please. Leave them be. Whoever reads this, I ask you to take extreme care with these crystals. Even after 500 years, they still radiate power. Uh, Nuclear crystals. Well, the summer is waiting for the ruins. Uh, my family holds very true. I to hold the fate of many in his hands. The father has told me I was all the more. This it was told to him and his father, and so on. Do your best, young man. Why well, not? Some guy, man. What's he doing here? Yep, they pinch the water crystal. Some information for you. Three years ago, Stern decided to go north to look into the crystals. Right, north is the bloody um, the waterfall. No one knows if he's ever actually found them there. Sadly, that's when when missing himself. Let's search to the north for now. I suspect the road ahead will only go more treacherous. 
lead to the crystals we have yet to be found. Well, that's the best outcome I can hope for. If not, hope you see this through to the end with me. As always, your best, young man. Oh, young man. Okay. You do. Alright, uh, they were there before. We made it through the fast without getting attacked. Everyone don't want to begin the ship loaded up with some of the serious cargo. I'm sure it was huge, whatever it was. Okay. Let's go to the bar then. We get back to work again. What change the most I can pick up anymore? Best of all, we need to enjoy a good drink at the town. Time for resting and time for drinking. Saves the date as uh, Adol. Uh, Man of creatures I've seen. I think I'm going to be pretty busy for now on. Okay. Need to be taking my time for the store. Thanks, I'm going to keep close. Uh, let's have a look. Everyone by the red dead side, right? This is to keep the business pretty lively. Ruins with a fair bit of history to it. Well, since we've got the business showing up here, something must be going on in the forest. Any last nice invitation to the forest? Let's even get back on the roof to talk to that guy. Check of a shop. It's got the same goods. Yeah, they have. Nothing new there then. If you're about to attack the crystal from the ruins, which are here with this red snake. Okay. No, we have to be sure it's. Oh well. Okay. Let's go into the inn and save it. Seems I got this far. I'm trying to go north now in a second. Just in the jungle they plan to launch an expedition to the north. Ah, right, okay. Right, let me go and see you in a minute and get some more anti antidotes. I suppose you may taste some of the kind, for sure you have uh, to get them the desert to the east. And on top of that, they um, will some sound uh, such nonsense. Okay, we hear the richness of the desert, maybe it's true. Right, it doesn't sound like there's anything else to do in here.
Let's have a look if the waterfall is drained. Hear <coughs> those things, pain in the ass. That seems to be pretty greedy to get that, wouldn't it? Poison straight away. Waterfall drained. Nope. Oh, it's not. Definitely didn't drain it. <laughs> yeah. So I'm not quite sure where to go myself now. Say something about this summon waiting for me in, in the uh, ruins. <coughs> I'll have a look at them. Good. Let's have a look. I got nothing to spend on. <laughs> right. Was there somebody in these ruins waiting for me? Nope. I think he was lying. Catch a ride over here. Oh, it's the time quarter one. I call it a night in a minute, guys. I'll work a rest out tomorrow, I think. I'll play for in the day. Go back and save it though. The bosses are not particularly too hard in this game. <laughs> It's quite nice because I just played through um, East 4 and they're a little bit tricky on them. All for Fulgana, the boss is tricky. Well, 
Right then, guys, I'm gonna call it a night. It was fun for Thursday evening. Ooh. What's the time? Quarter two. It's probably good timing. There's a PayPal. Check my email, see if anyone loves me. Um, no. <laughs> right, alright, guys, cheers for that. I'm gonna shoot off. Cheers for hanging around and stuff. Cheers for the chat. And uh, so I'll be back on on. Uh, it'll probably be Monday now. <laughs> so I got a busy weekend. Normally I do on the weekends, but uh, I can't do it this weekend. Gonna have to all weekend off. So. Cheers for hanging around, guys. Cheers for watching. So, I know, I know Venture Games is probably not the most exciting to watch, but I've never played for this one, so I've got to complete it because I want to play. I want to complete all the uh, East games. I'm getting it. I've literally got out of the main games. I've got one left after this, so I'm getting it. So, all right. Cheers for that, and um, I say have a good weekend and stuff. We'll work too hard tomorrow and I'll, uh, I'll catch you on Monday. Unless I don't go out tomorrow and I'll be back on tomorrow, but I, I doubt it. I'll probably be popping out for five. So, anyway, nighty night, guys. Cheers for that. Ta da! -da.